How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another Car Mechanic Simulator 18 video and as you guys can tell here and from the title and thumbnail we are going to be working on a tractor today. Yes, that is right. That is correct. A tractor in a farming sim. This is actually the Lamborghini Nitro. Um, it comes stock with a trying to remember 3.6 4 liter is that what this has too go well, this is this or not 4 liter uh inline 4 yeah okay so it comes with an i4 in this game and in real life it comes with a 3.6 liter uh inline 4 what does it push 99 horsepower max in real life yeah in real life it has 99 horsepower and 397 uh, Newton meters of torque, uh, four cylinders. Yep, with a maximum curb weight with cab at 4,500 kilograms. So she's a big one. It is a. This is obviously, guys. As you can tell, it's a small, small tractor. Oh, what's the price on this one? Okay, so the price right now that we're running at is twenty-seven thousand dollars. Um, when you buy one of these bad boys, brand new in real life, it starts for like the low option. Obviously, not like fully built up, bigger engine, all that. It starts at $94,600. So our goal is going to be hitting $94,000, which I think is possible. I mean, it's Lamborghini. It's going to be expensive. We all know it's going to be expensive. And uh, and we're already at $27,000, so it shouldn't take long. Um, in this video, though, guys, we are going to be uh, doing some body work on it. We'll be doing body work, painting, and doing all the good stuff. Um, we're going to turn this to white, though. Uh, for painting, we're definitely gonna turn this to one to white. We gotta this whole whole thing is really really bad. But hey, the modder who created this mod did an amazing job. Uh, it's got a three point attachment. It doesn't have a PTO. Wait, no, it does have a PTO. Ah, it hooks up right there to suspension. This is actually a really 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 good mod. Um, but yeah, this one I guess is the Nitro 120. Uh, it's the Nitro 100, but you get the 120, the 110, I think, the 130, and it goes all the way up to, I don't even know, there's, let me check, it goes all the way up to, where's it at, I don't even know, it goes all the way up, okay, yeah, one, okay, so yeah, so we have the 120, okay, yeah, 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 so this one's 118 horsepower, and still $94,000, so, alright, we'll be trying to push off that, let's get started, Get this thing up onto the lift. We're gonna get the tires off. All right, and I don't know if these are off-roading or standard tires. Let's check that out, hold on. And obviously both of are, I'm pretty sure the front and rear are both gonna have to be unrealistic tire sizes. Just because I don't think you can do anything else. All right, I think these are probably maxed out at the 550. Right, let's check it out. What do we got here for sizes? 520. Okay, let me grab my sticky notes per usual, as you guys know I do. So 520, 78. What are they? A 30. No offset. And then the fronts are 27s. 70. How is that a 78 profile? There's, I don't think it's got to be an even number. And the fives are ten. Okay, whatever. It's fine. And then three seventy-five. Okay. So then, <sighs> those are basics. So we'll just sell these. We know what we need now. We don't need it. Um, let me sell all of our bad parts. There we go. Okay. So first things first is let's get some new tires going. Um, I'm not going to do suspension in this. I might do a little bit of the brakes. I'm just rework the brakes a little bit, but not the suspension. Okay, so we need to find some deep dished rims here. Some, something, some rims that aren't at the edge, but they go curve in quite a bit. Because that's what the actual rims look like. Honestly, like rim twos, rim number two was not too bad. It goes in a little bit. It's got a couple holes in it. Let's do it. So we need two of these at, what size? 27 first. Then we need another two at, what is this, 30? 
Well, we are two away from max size, so jeez. Um, off-road tires, of course. Can't be doing non-off-road tires. So we're doing 27s again. Um, with this is going to be 375 for this one. Let's crank that down. And profile is 70. All right. That's not too bad. $1,000 for these tires. I've seen people pay way more. Then three zero with five twenty maxing her out, and then profile you can't see you can't do seventy eight. We're going to do eighty. We'll go for the bigger one. Now those big boys are a little bit more expensive than before. Okay, so let's join these. So we'll join the thirties to the thirty. Oh mama. Um, I'm gonna go in and sell those Mustang rims real quick just because I don't need them. Oh, here, hold on. Let's open these cases. Oh, we got an engine block. What is it? What is it? Please be a V8. It should be a V8. Yes, a regular V8 engine block. And then, what else do we get in this? Barn find! Yes. All right, we'll go do that barn find in a second. Let's try to get rid of these Mach 1 rims that we don't need. Okay. Take you. All right, this is just going to glitch through here, but it's going to be funny to see anyways. I wonder what the actual size of the machine is that balances tire wheels. I feel like it might be something that a farmer might have on their farm but I'm not sure I feel like you don't change tractor tires out that often hey it didn't take too long oh even the front small tires still way 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 too big I think these are the biggest tires we've done to date I think these were even bigger than the bus tires that we did last time all right Thank you. You can do one more of these. And while we're waiting on that, um, I'm going to find out where the battery is on this bad boy. It's got to be up here. Can you take that clamshell off? Oh, yep, there it is. Now, I do love this, though. Uh, doing a tractor in this game is just so unique and different. I'm really, really, really digging it. But, yeah, this is the Lamborghini Nitro 120, for those of you guys who are wondering. Should check and see if they have more. All right, so there's that. We'll get the welder over there. And where is it? There it is. Interior detailing kit over there. Looks like our tire just finished balancing. Also, guys, I did find another F350 resto mod. It's a V8 double overhead cam, supercharged. It's dropped. It's lowered to the ground. We might be doing. We might be doing it soon if you guys like seeing those which I mean it looks like you guys did but I'm not sure all right so now that we get the tires and everything good um all right let's get the frame back in order let me pull the cab off so we got the front window I just have no idea what you can take off of this thing I don't even know what we're missing what we have what we don't have is the body at like zero then okay global body's at three so yeah we're missing pretty much everything all right so we'll Clean out all the dirt on the inside. All right, she's sparkling. And then the welder. So here is a before and after. You guys ready? Well, bam. Oh, we can take that fender off. So there you go. That's what it looks like now that we got that all done up. Oh, 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 oh. We can get that door off there. Is there anything else we can get off? There's not going to be nothing else. No way. Okay, that looks like everything. All right, let's get these back to their respective spots in the garage. All right, so now, can we repair any of those? We did, actually. Um, hold on, let me go grab this. So yeah, in next episode, we'll be doing, we'll be rebuilding the i4. We're gonna be upping the power in it, of course. Because this is a small little tractor, and we're going to try and give it just a little bit. Give it a bump up in power. Maybe get it up to the 150. Maybe, what was it at, actually? So this one's already at 156. Maybe get it up to 250 horsepower. 
That'll be really good for a tractor of this size. Like, insanely good, guys. Um, no. There we go. There's the battery. And then go for this. Get our clamshell put back on. That fender was not good. Dang it. Get out of there. Is it the right door? Nope. This door? Yes. We repaired something else though. What was it? Is it this fender? No. Okay, it's fine. Um, Alright. Now, let's go buy some body parts. Uh, body shop, body shop, body shop, body shop. Alright, so we're typing 120? Yes, okay. Oh, wow. It looks like every single one of these is a piece we need. At least these aren't ex too expensive, like the Lamborghini parts. Um, the Lamborghini parts are just ridiculous. So, Nitro window. So, we can get this one. Okay, front bumper. Oh, uh, we already got the clamshell. Front left door. Where they got all of our windows, front left fender, front right fender, tail light, tail light. All right, so we got the tinted stuff. So let's do this one. Let's see what this tinted one is. I think it adds like a GBS or something to the top here. Let's see. Uh, front, no, it's the, is it the front window or back window? Oh, well, there's that. Oh, baby. She's got a spoiler. Oh, my gosh. All right, that has to come off. We cannot do that. We cannot put a spoiler on this thing. I'm sorry, I can't do that. <laughs> it's just too much. Way too much. Okay, we're just gonna go regular windows and everything. All right, there we go. Mainly because I know some of you guys out there would freak out if you saw me put on a spoiler. Um, let me see, there's that. Okay, so we missed our right side door. I thought we had our right side door for some reason. Okay, get that. Here. The door is literally just windows, so it doesn't really matter anyways. Alright, is that it? 85%. Gotta be missing something here. Obviously, we're missing something if it's not giving us 100%. Let's see what there's else to buy. Left headlights. Okay, so headlights. Yeah, yeah, we got headlights on there. There they are. These little buggers. 96. What are we missing? Front bumper. Where in the heck is the bumper? Front clamshell. Oh, well, wait, there it is. I see the front bumper, but it doesn't let me work on it. Hmm. Weird. Let me try something here. Nope, that did not work. That just caused more work for me. Dang it. Okay. So, looks like we can't get that front bumper on. Hmm. That is weird. Okay. Um, let's slap on our tires really quick. Okay. So, these are going to be the 27s. Yeah, these will work. They don't look the greatest. I know, guys. I know. But it's what we have to work with. At least they'll match. Alright, see the 520s in the rear. I can't even scroll around to see their side. Alright, let's get this bad boy on. You know, because you only need five lugs to hold these wheels on. In reality, I think we'd have like 14 or something like that. It's, it'd be stupid. Which be an insane amount. Alright, there we go. Um, now it's time to go paint this bad boy. Let's go move this to paint shop. I'm pretty sure that these are white and black usually. I'm pretty sure. Let me check. 
that's all I'm seeing them as right now is like a white or this weird pearly gray like we have kind of going on the front here here let's let's hop in the paint shop and see what we can do okay so factory was this olive green so we're gonna crank brightness up and drop our hue down so we're gonna go with a gray where's it good like a hint of blue maybe this is kind of as gray as we can get it without going too dark because they're it's like gray white and black is there livery on it let's check this really quick no uh matt also looks really good on here i think oh chrome though chrome isn't too bad obviously with the rust spots on this right now it looks terrible but chrome's not bad um i think what about chameleon chameleon looks pretty good here yeah it's like an that's like a silver yeah i like it i think i think that's pretty good um what do we have for seats is my question and steering wheel what the heck are we gonna do there's no there's no tractor steering wheel in here let me see here lamb nothing there's no lamborghini okay well oh let's see here Mm, 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 mm. I don't really want to put a bucket here. Try this one. So I don't really want to put a bucket seat in this. And then for tractor, I kind of just want to go with the straight up steering wheel three. That's what I always do on everything. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go steering wheel three. That'll, that'll look, look good. This is assuming we could even put seats in here. Ah, oh, we can. Okay. Slide that guy in. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work good. I like it. Okay. Next thing. Move it back over to entrance. I'm gonna take a quick look at it, see what we look at looking at for price so far. Um Okay, there you go. What do they call this front part? Oh, this is the front bumper? What? no yeah all right sweet 100 percent on the body condition this is this is where i wanted to get to 100 percent on the body 100 percent on the frame 100 percent on the interior right now we're sitting at ninety one thousand dollars before we've even touched the motor or suspension easily gonna double our the value of this bad boy um come next video uh next video though i will be doing i'll do all the suspension parts ahead of time like i usually do just because it uh, helps get it out of the way a little bit easier um, but then we'll be doing a full rebuild on this motor here. We're going to be uh, performance, adding performance pieces to it, turning it from probably like a 120 nitro to maybe like a what is what's the next variation? So there's the nitro VRT. We could do the. It would basically be not even that. It would just shoot through the roof. It'd be closer to a 130 VRT like a nitro 130 vrt tractor um but honestly it might even just go way beyond that just because it's already at 156 so more realistic more realistically this would be at 118 right now and then we would upgrade it to around 180 um but we're gonna probably push this sucker clear past 250 um i think i think that's what we'll do but you guys will just have to find out in the next video um i hope you guys enjoyed this i really enjoyed this this is such a weird thing to work on in this game but it's super, super fun. I mean, I, I love it. I hope you guys love it too. Uh, kind, of kind, of, kind of ties in with Farming Simulator just a wee bit. Um, but if you guys enjoyed this, hit that like button. Subscribe if you guys are not subscribed yet. And I will see you all in the next Car Mechanic Simulator video. See you guys.